All eight motor vehicle branches are back open in Jefferson County today, one week after a cyber attack took out the system. Our WLKY Madeline Carter checked out the largest branch on Dixie Highway while employees worked as fast as they could to serve a backlog of customers. The Dixie branch is so packed you can hardly get a seat. And all these people, they're anxiously waiting for their numbers to be called so that they can reaccess essential services that were knocked out by a ransomware hacker. A83. Maxine Petit packed her patience when she came to renew her car tags, knowing it would be slow after the recent cyber attack. The workers, they, they're doing their best. They're putting us through as fast as they could in there. She says it took about an hour to get up to the counter. Today was the longest amount of time I've ever spent here. But others in this sea of customers weren't so positive. Very frustrating. I just wanted to get my registration taken care of for the year. Don Johnson Jr. didn't have time to wait and left with his family. The Jefferson County Clerk's Office acknowledged the lengthy process to get all eight branches back up and running. These hackers are determined, they are global, they know what they're doing, and they look for any type of opening they can get in. Ashley Tinius says the FBI is still working to determine how the hackers got into the government system and shut down operations. As of Monday, legal records and marriage licensing were still down. 300 computers were checked and cleared, and Tinius insists no personal information was stolen. We have no reason whatsoever to believe that any data was compromised. They were simply holding our network hostage. When asked whether the clerk's office paid ransom, we're told that was never an option. I'm not sure what the amount was, but we are a taxpayer funded agency, so we cannot pay ransom. As cyber attack recovery continues, Tinius says new protocols will be put in place at all branches to ensure hackers never again get in the way of serving customers. You have a blessed day. Thank you. In Jefferson County, Madeline Carter. WLKY News. And right now, vehicle registration and renewal is open, but there's no estimate on when you'll be able to get legal records and marriage licenses. In the meantime, you can request those documents from surrounding counties, which have agreed to help until at least midweek.